So what I'm going to do now, under our content section, we do have a lot of different content on here. I'm going to pull out some shapes, drag out a square, resize that, put it back to zero. What we've got here is a split icon. So if I click the split icon at the top and then go to tools and click split, if you're teaching fractions, etc., what this allows us to do is equally split this square up. So I can drag it one way, and as you can see, I've got some numbers. If I drag it down, so we can make that three by three square, it's now split that up for me. Just while I'm on content, you've got some blue folders, which are pre-installed content if you like, clip art if you like. You've got different options here and they just drag out. And then I've got some green folders at the bottom and they're my directories. So this is where I've mapped a particular folder on a staff share drive, for instance. So again, if I go back to tools options, where we started with, I've got the folder icon. And then what this allows me to do, if I click on the plus, it then allows me to, to go to my share drive. In this case, I'm gonna to go to Google Drive and I've gone down one, two, three. I'm going to select um, pictures. And click, select the folder, click apply and OK. And now I've got this option here. So if I then click on my folder, that was my resources that were five or six layers down on my Google Drive. That could be your share drive. It just saves continuously going into those directories for that and again I can then just drag out whatever it is I wanted to do etc. Same for PowerPoint files I can drag a file over and convert that if I need to.